Hello and welcome back to News from the Road. Our news is that our car can't go any further, so we have to get it towed. All right, we just backtracked 30 kilometers. Apparently someone can fix the car here. We're probably just gonna pass out here. So Daisy's fixed, we spent the night in this over there, and we're back on the road. Medellin, here we come. Did anybody take the spare keys off the thing hanging? Give me the keys. Mark. No, we don't. You heard these keys. No, you heard these keys. Oh, uh, the keys are locked in the car. Now that's what happens when you leave both keys in the car and lock it. The window is too tent. I can see where I'm going. Don't try this at home, kids. Great success. We have access to the car again. We're in Medellin. How do you like one-way streets? I fucking hate you guys. Medellin! Now we're up in the mountains. As you can see, the city doesn't seem to end. It goes up all the way up to the mountains, the little barrios. And the people up here are incredibly friendly. Okay, bye guys! Hasta luego! Yeah. We've escaped Medellin to the beautiful mountain town of Huatape. So glad someone told us about it. We're almost up on 2,000 meters. There's uh, lots of lakes and mountains, and the village is beautiful too. Guatape has recently been dubbed the most colorful city in the world, and it is indeed colorful. Voy buscando un buen amor que me acepte como soy. Que comprenda mi mundo. Que the little village, two hours outside of Medellin, also seems like one of the most dog-friendly places I've seen in a long time. Okay, what are we doing today? Today we're getting the bike and we're trying to find a mysterious rock in the mountains here in Guatape. Riding through the beautiful countryside of Antioquia. It's great to be here. This really is quite tiring, but the landscape makes up for everything. It's gorgeous out here. The reason most people come here is this strange little rock. It's just one rock, nothing else around it. We made it up to the bottom of the rock, had something nice to eat, but now it's climbing up all these stairs. 649 to be precise. Beautiful. I'm gonna push you off, Marco, if it's not amazing at the top, though. This was a little harder than expected, but so worth it. Wow. Incredible. It's actually 659 and not 649. These 10 steps made all the difference. Super view. But then we flew our drone into the rock. It was almost on top of the rock sitting there. And we send up climbers day after day to recover it. After waiting for four days, we decided to do something different. Did we get the drone back? Did we move on? Find it out in the next clip.